What you got, Milo? That toy's almost as big as you, Milo. <laughs> that toy's almost as big as you. <laughs> all the boys are, well, they were just out here. Grant and Max left. Merlin's sleeping in the Christmas bed. Mozzie, Mozzie, <laughs> you trying to get Merlin out of the Christmas bed so you can lay in it? <laughs> you little stinker. You're a little stinker. Yes, you get up on the couch and get in this little bed. Yes, get in this little bed. Um. Okay, so I got all the garland on the tree, and I put a bowl on top. Um, I'm going to have all my schnauzer ornaments on this tree. I decided so far that I'm only going to have this tree up. We will see. I don't know. Um, usually I put this... Um, stuffed schnauzer over here i usually put this on top of the tree it's got like a little snowflake cat um i usually put that on top but i just cannot get him to sit right on top of the tree so i think i'm just gonna go with this bow and then put all my schnauzer ornaments on so i think that's what i'm gonna do so now i've got to get all my, I'm going to get all my schnauzer ornaments out and lay them on the dining room table. They're all in these totes right here. I had my son come over earlier today and I told him I'd buy him lunch if <laughs> he got all my Christmas totes down, which are all in my laundry room. <laughs> I have too much stuff, guys. I, I told them bring everything down that I own Christmas and I'm gonna go through everything this year and anything that's not meaningful, um, I'm gonna donate. So I wanna cut some of these totes down. It's just, that's just too much. <laughs> that's just too much. Um, so, so anyways, it is, what time is it? It's like four, almost 4.20. So I'm gonna get all the schnauzer ornaments out, lay them out. And start hanging them on the tree. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Look at them. They just can't stand that Merlin's in their Christmas bed. <laughs> can't even. Can you even see the outline of the kitty? It's just like a black blob. Let's try to get your face in here, kitty. Yes, you like the Christmas bed, don't you? Yes, especially when a fire's going. So does Magnum. Uh, Merlin and Magnum love laying in front of the fire getting toasty. All right, let's get this tree decorated. All right, here's all the schnauzer ornaments. That's Marley squeaking a toy. <laughs> all the schnauzer ornaments. Those ones are sitting on dish towels so they don't roll off the table. Um, a lot of you have sent me these. I'm missing uh, some from a gentleman who sent me some schnauzer ornaments from the Danbury Mint. So they're either upstairs in a box that wasn't marked Christmas or they're in one of these many red coats in my laundry room. But here's some of the ones he sent me from the Danbury Mint. This one is 2012. So there's some here on the end here that are from the different years that the Danbury Mint put out schnauzer ornaments. Um, so I know I have another box of them, so I got to find them. And I think there were some hand, uh, someone had made me some ornaments that had pictures of the boys. Those must be in one of the red to totes somewhere. So if you're watching and you don't see them, it's because I haven't found them yet. <laughs> but we're going to start with these until I can find them. And then we'll fill in the spots with the other ones once I find them. So quite a collection, eh? <laughs> And we do have some kitty ones. There's one for kitten. There's one for Merlin. We got this little kitty one. I thought I had a couple more kitty ones too. Um, so I'm gonna have to look for those. I probably was packing up everything and probably found, you know how sometimes when you pack up your tree, you're taking the ornaments off and then you're, then you start taking down the garland and stuff. And then you find ornaments you missed and forgot and didn't get off the tree. That's what I do sometimes. And then I just throw them in whatever boxes, uh, by me so <laughs> I know they're somewhere I just got to find them so but I'm gonna get to um, getting these ones up on the tree and then once I find the other ones we'll fill in any bare spots with it
I almost forgot. I got a Christmas card today from Alma and Tiffany, and they sent me a new schnauzer ornament. Isn't it cute? So thank you guys so, so much. And I'm so happy you enjoy the videos. Um, yeah, I got that today in the mail. I'm so excited. So thank you, Alma and Tiffany. All right, we have some progress going on. Oh! Yes, we do, don't oh. we? Okay, so we have some on. Let's see if you can even see them. Doggy bone. Yeah, we have some on. This one I don't know about. <laughs> For some of the doggies. <laughs> it's kind of it's getting dark. But we're getting there. We're getting there. I still have a lot more to go. A lot more to go, but we're getting there. So I think I'm going to end filming tonight and we'll pick back up tomorrow when it's not so dark. As you can see, it's it's dark. It's, uh, what time is it? It's 5.30, so it's dark. Um, so we will pick this back up tomorrow. I'll show you the finished product. Happy Tuesday, guys. We got more snow last night, didn't we, Maggie? Yes, we did. These guys are looking for the squirrel up in the tree. He's in the next yard by his nest. <laughs> but they come in your yard every now and then, don't they? He's going to get a ball. You see him? Oh, I see him. I see him. See him sitting in that tree right there? See if I can zoom in more. Yep. Naughty squirrel. It's a naughty squirrel, isn't it? Yes, yeah, naughty. <laughs> Not much snow back here. Not much snow under the pine tree. No. Not much snow under here. Yep. I'm going to go shovel the deck off and uh, might make a little bit some paths. Look, at they kind of made a path. See their path, the fence line? Marley walks the fence line constantly. Yes, he does. Marley, you love walking the fence line. Yes. Miggy, you don't know. Hey, Miggy. Oh. <laughs> Miggy, you don't know where your ball is, do you? Miggy. He's too worried about the squirrel. Miggy, where's your ball? Where's your ball? Where's your ball? Go find it. It's by the fire pit. Go get your ball. <laughs> He's like, there's, but there's a squirrel. No, not that ball. Miggy, not that ball. Go find your ball. Go get your other ball. Go get it. It's over by the fire pit. No, not that one. That one's hard to kick. Go get your ball. Go get your ball. He's like, I don't know where it is, Ron. Where is it? It was over there. I kicked it by the fire pit. <laughs> Where's your ball? He's got to see it. He's right there. He is. You were right next to it. You were right next to it. <laughs> He's like, it's snowy and cold, Mom. My ball is snowy and cold. <laughs> you getting snow up your nose? You're getting all snowy, too. Yes. All right, I'm going to go shovel. Trying, I'm standing out in the cold so I wake up. <laughs> I need to wake up, Maggie, so I can get stuff done. I'm taking way too long to decorate my house for Christmas. I just, 
I thought the snow would get me in the mood, but I'm just not in the mood to decorate. I'm just not. So, yeah. Hopefully this cold wakes me up. And I, get, I have a long list of stuff to do today. So, let's get to it. Let's get to it, Magnum. Let's get to it, snowy face. Yes. <laughs> All right, we have the tree decorated. <laughs> the tree is done. <laughs> Let me show you some of the ornaments on here. We'll start at the top and kind of browse our way down. don't do the back of the tree because why <laughs> no one sees it I mean I do go back a little bit let's see can I get that one well, it looks like I need to maybe add some right here I was decorating when it was uh, dark out and the lighting isn't the greatest in here. So, I do see some spots this morning that I probably could fill in. Because I do still have a couple extra, but I was gonna, uh, I was contemplating um, putting up the tree in the other room. I love this one here, this little girl holding the schnauzer. I love that one. Found that at, oh, did I find it at Hobby Lobby last year? I can't remember. I don't know if that's really a schnauzer, but close enough. <laughs> My husband got me that one uh, when he was in Frankenmuth at Bronner's Christmas store. I know I'm not catching all of the bulbs. of the Christmas ornaments because they're not all bulbs. There was one I was going to show you. Oh, this one. I love this one too. <laughs> love that one too. So, yep. I do see some spots maybe I'll fill in a little, but let's see. Let me back up. So Christmas tree is done. I'll share it tonight with the lights on. So now I have this mess I'm working on. Yes, I got all this stuff I need to put out and I still have many totes to go through. I did put some stuff out in the schnauzer room. Now, if you remember the chair that was right here, my husband just put it in this room in front of the window. <laughs> yeah, he just stuck it there. If I put the tree up, it'll go right there. So one of these, that chair for sure I'll have to go in the corner if I do put the tree up, but... I put, uh, the boys are enjoying the sunshine today. We haven't seen the sunshine in a while, have we, boys? No. Um, I did get some stuff put out here. I put a couple signs down there. So still working on it. Still working on it. I still got to put... Um, some things up there, but yeah, the boys are loving the sunshine coming in the windows. I'm supposed to, in the next couple days, get in the 40s, so all the snow will melt, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully it'll melt. I think we're supposed to get actually some rain. Yeah, so most of it will melt. All right, let's get back to it. I thought I'd show the kitties relaxing, too. Oh, they're out here in their little kitty corner, as I call it. They're out here taking a nap. Kitten loves having a kitty bed here in front of the heat vent. That's where he sleeps in the winter. Um, in the summer, he's upstairs because it's always warm up there. And in the winter, he's down here. And we bought him this little Christmas kitty bed, TJ Maxx. 
You cozy kitten? He's, he's out. <laughs> okay, guys. Happy Thursday. So I finally got the whole house decorated and cleaned. <laughs> got everything put away and cleaned. So um, I thought I'd share it with you guys in case you're interested in seeing the Christmas decor. And these boys over here are hunting for squirrels in the house. They're watching. If they see when they run to the back door, all the snow has melted. It's 50 degrees today, guys. <laughs> yes, 50 degrees out today. So there's a little bit of, well, no, almost all the snow on the porch is gone too. Yep, looks like a spring day out there. Doesn't it, Miggy? Doesn't it? Okay, so let's start with the kitchen. So in the kitchen, let me take off my flip-flops so they don't make noise. On these dogs want to go out. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Here come the stragglers. <laughs> they have been enjoying this mild weather. Yes, they have. They have been enjoying it. They've been in and out, in and out, in and out. Just like my sign here. Yep, that's every day when it's nice out. <laughs> All right, in the kitchen. In the kitchen, I just have in my window. Well, I have some Tootsie Rolls on this candy dish. <laughs> and then I have these uh, Christmas signs, radon, Christmas candles I found this year at um, TJ Maxx. I know you're enjoying the lovely camera work. <laughs> and then this gnome I got from Linda is sitting over here. Um, that's it for out here. Oh, and I do have a Christmas towel hanging. I do have a Christmas towel. Um, okay. Out here, here's our table. I got that centerpiece at JCPenney on clearance a couple years ago. Got it for a great deal with my daughter's discount. And here's our buffet. I'm trying not to show the mail that's sitting in the tray so I get no one's addresses. Lighting's kind of um, gray in here because it's cloudy and overcast outside. And there's the tree. I took the bow off because I ended up putting the other tree up in the front room. Um, and I put the schnauzer on top but I ordered a different topper. It's coming tomorrow. So the tree is all decorated. I think I already showed the bulbs. I did add some more Christmas ornaments onto it uh, to fill it in. And then here's our fireplace. And then I have this uh, countdown to Christmas calendar. I got at Bronner's. It's kind of got a reflection on it. Um, and then I have my mother-in-law's nativity scene here. She gave it to me last year. There's more to it, but it went off it on this table, and this is where I ended up putting it. So there's more. You hear my kitty? That's a kitten. He's walking around with a little mouse toy in his mouth. Talking. <laughs> I got my holiday pillows here on the couch. And my Christmas blankets. What are you doing? Where's your little toy that was in your mouth? Hmm? He'll put a little toy in his mouth and then he stands by the window staring at birdies. Talking because he wants to go out and get the birdies. <laughs> then I got the little red Christmas truck on my humidifier. A sign there. And then I've got some decor on the top of my bookcases and a couple pieces on the top shelves. <laughs> Another sign here in the corner. What are you walking around making noises for? Hmm? You trying to get some attention? Huh? You're silly kitty. Yes. Okay. 
and out here. Okay. Well, first of all, got to, I found, have one Christmas bed left. I thought I had two, but I forgot the one got a hole in it last year. Couldn't be fixed. So we got one Christmas bed. I'm on the hunt for more Christmas beds. They're very hard to find. Um, I think I found that one at TJ Maxx last year. And then I've got my Schnauzer tree. I had two of them. Uh, lovely subscribers uh, gave them to me. Um, and then this was also given to me by a subscriber. As long as this Schnauzer train. All these pieces on the um, TV stand here are from the Danbury Mint. And then over my fireplace shelves here. Got that little, I think it's a Schnauzer. They called it a Westie on Cole's site uh, a couple years ago, but I think it looks like a Schnauzer. Cutie! <laughs> then we've got this sign here with a couple little Schnauzers, and I found these little guys at Michael's a couple years ago by their village, Christmas village set. Cutie! You're being very vocal today. Yes, you are. Oh, and I got these pillows here. Pillows here on the chairs. This one was sent to me by a subscriber. Um, and I've got this sign here. And then some little pine trees. Another sign there. And then, of course, I have the stockings hanging. And then this tree, this is where I moved the bow to. Um, this tree has some family ornaments and then it's got the other Danbury mint uh, and other ornaments on it, Schnauzer ornaments on it, which let me see, here's one here. It's a Schnauzer laying in a doggy bed. Um, let me see if I can find, here's one here. This one isn't Danbury Mint. That's just, I think this one was from Hobby Lobby. Oh, here's one right here. Yep, so I've got some Christmas our, um, Chanel's ornaments mixed in with family um, ornaments on this tree. So that's it, guys. That's all my Christmas decor. I hope you guys liked seeing it. Hope you like to listen to Kent and talk. Here's Merlin. Here's Merlin watching the birdies. <laughs> Are you having a good time watching those birdies? Yes? Oh, here's Grant. Grant, you didn't want to go outside with everybody? He's like, it's almost lunchtime. <laughs> it's almost lunchtime. Where is everybody? <laughs> Let's go see if they want in, Grant. Yep, there's the toy kitten hand in his mouth. He always carries a toy around. Yep. Alright, let's go see if these boys want in. I was gonna share this with the tree lit up, but it's on a timer, and those timers take me forever to figure out, so I didn't want to mess with it. So, I apologize for not showing it lit up. Maybe I'll catch it tonight, um, if I remember. We have a uh, funeral visitation and funeral tomorrow for um, the family member that passed away before Thanksgiving, so... This has been a crazy busy week, you guys. Yes, it has. Crazy busy with cleaning, decorating, um, and just other things going on in life. You guys ready to come in? <laughs> Mickey says, I'm ready to play ball. <laughs> I'm ready to play ball. It's nice out. <laughs> really? Okay. I got flip flops on, though. I got flip flops on. Oh, Magnum's gonna get his goosey. <laughs> okay, one more time. You gonna keep biting it? One more time, Miggy. One more time. Okay. 
Okay, one more time. Here we go. He's just, he just leaps off the porch. Max, you better be, you better be careful, Max. You're gonna fall. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope everybody has a great weekend, and we'll see you guys again in our next video. Bye. All right, guys. Thought I'd hop back on and show you the tree all lit up. I feel like it's leaning this way a little. I'm going to have to prop it up. I don't know if it's the way the tree topper's on or if the tree's leaning. I'm going to have to have my family look at it. Or if it's the way the tree is shaped. You guys tell me in the comments below. <laughs> it's about quarter to eight. I'm really tired. <laughs> it's only quarter to eight and I'm like ready for bed. Um, anyways, here's the tree all lit up. See, now when I look at it like this, it looks fine. Maybe it's just the angle I'm standing at. There's the tree all lit up. Like I said, I ordered a new tree chopper that'll be here tomorrow, or supposedly will be here tomorrow, because I put the bow that was on it on the tree in the front room. If you hear any noises, it's my husband and daughter. They're watching a movie in the front room, if you hear talking going on. Um, but I also bought a different sign for this corner here, right here. If you remember, I had a sign that said believe. Well, I saw this one at Hobby Lobby today when we were out shopping, my daughter and I, and it was um, 15 bucks. And I thought it matched, because it's got the red, white, and green. I thought it matched the let it snow sign a little bit better. Because you know, like I said previously, I like to mirror things, my daughter says. <laughs> and also, up here in my previous clip, one of my signs had fallen. It had fallen down. I didn't know that, so I fixed it. So I did have a sign in that spot, but it had fallen. <laughs> Must have fallen when somebody walked by, not sure. Milo and Max are outside, so these dogs are wondering what they're doing. Do you want to go out too? Do you want to go out too? <laughs> of course. Of course you want to go out too. Of course. Let's see if our lights are on outside today. Oh, yep. The back lights are on today. All the snow is gone, so they lit up. It's still pretty mild out right now. I think it's about... I bet you it's about 40. It's not too bad. It's not too bad out, Milo. <laughs> All right. Just wanted to show you the tree lit up. My new sign... Bought a couple new uh, ornaments too for the family tree um, for everybody. Um, while we were at Hobby Lobby, bought some wrapping paper. What else did I buy? I don't remember. Some gift tags, stuff like that. Um, yeah, I went out shopping for a little bit. Just needed to. Oh, did you see Milo? <laughs> what in the world, Milo? Now that the hot tub's gone and the flowers um, that I usually hang between the bushes here are gone, everybody leaps off the uh, porch. Don't ya? Max don't usually, but um, yeah, everybody's been leaping off the porch. <laughs> Grant even leaped off the porch when there was snow. Uh, when there's not snow, he don't do that. But when there's snow, he feels the need to leap off the porch. Looks like Milo and Miggy are gonna play. You went into the darkness. <laughs> you boys are silly. Magnum's gonna bark at the neighbor. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna end the video. Probably a long one. Talk to you guys later. Bye.